Hey guys, we'll do some Richie's again here. So it is nice out. It's September 15th. It's Tuesday. However, today's the clearest day of the last four. It's all smoky out. I guess we're breathing that California, Oregon, Washington forest fire air. I've never seen that here in decades. So it's crazy. Just like a it's like fog. Alright, so here's a here's an old one, 1984. Ring power. I think that was someone named Randy Ringhaver that had that. So don't know how I know, but I think they've been bought out a long time ago or disappeared or something. Super clean looking cat. Uh, showroom floor there. Paint sells. Adds about ten thousand dollars a gallon. I think the big guys all know that. That's why the auction has the nicest looking equipment. Looking, that is, doesn't mean necessarily mean it's the best operating equipment. You've heard of an OROPS, an open rollover protective structure. That's a no ROPS, no rollover protective structure. And the DJBs ran a 25, which was the four wheel one. I just scan over this in case somebody wants to see a serial number, a certain machine or model number, year number. Brings back memories or they're still running it. And a skitter in Florida. And a wheel buncher. And JCB. They weren't the prettiest designed machine out there. Kind of a big tank. That's got to be like a 1974, three year five with the pointy cab. And some classics here. JSW is Japan Steelworks. And I keep forgetting who they became if it was Hyundai. Hyundai excavators swallowed them up. I haven't pre-looked at any of these, even opened them, so. Well, not for a long time. Mac attacks. I 
got some gold in there, some Warner Swayze's. Hopefully we get to see a picture of one. John Deere. That's the big brother to the 350 and the 450s. You were something if you had a deer. Had one of those. They were called the Triple Nickel. Was their nickname? I do believe there was a big Cummins engine called the same. pretty small grader I do believe I've seen something that size called an alat an a-l-a-a-t similar to that I think for paving or parking lot stuff <laughs> 1980s truck museum there that'd be its own car show today just about Favco crane. I've got some old video I'll probably never upload of some of these that were on C-SPAN barges back decades ago. You know, long nose Volvos. In great contrast to the DJB trucks. Didn't have a big front nose. Uh, over to Alberta, there's a beehive burner. Those used to be a common sight, common smell. Now you might not love this, this is sawmill. whole different game if you like bulldozers you may or may not like chips and hoggers and and dogging scrag mills and gang saws and planers and edgers mountain logger the white ones odd looking d7 the bubble nose weird canopy almost looks russian soviet logging That's the second biggest case. They made a W36 as well. Ah, uh, that's a misprint. Anybody that knows everything on this channel would right away say that those are mountain loggers. Those are not Clarks. So. Bet your money on that. So. Well, guarantee that's no contest. So.
somebody will like that. I've heard of up to Alice Chalmers M6. I'm not a military guy, but M8 isn't a number you hear of in the logging around the yarders. Not ringing a bell. Interesting. More wood equipment. And I got one more, I think for 11 minutes. We'll do that one next time. All right, thanks for hanging out. See you guys.